the PMD Transition Flymph, originated by Alan McGee. These flies are, in essence, weighted flymphs straddling the space between the deep fished nymph and the emerger in the film. The hook is a standard wet fly hook, size 16. The first material on is some fine, bright copper wire. I'm leaving the tag end long because it will form the rib of the pattern. Simply attach it as if it was thread and then run touching turns to the end of the shank or slightly before the end. Like this. The front part of the fly will be a hackle, which consists of the shoulder feather of a Hungarian partridge, just a tiny feather. The thread is Benecki 12 volt in tobacco. Tie down the hackle at the eye, then Trim away the waist. And then cover the copper wire with thread to secure it. And finally worry off the tag end that I don't want. Tail and abdomen are three pheasant tail barbs. Tails are relatively short. Only this. Just tie it down and lift up the barbs and run the thread to the thorax position. With the pheasant tail form the abdomen, running it to the thorax position and tie off, then trim away any excess. Then counter rib the abdomen. Tie it off and again worry it away. The thorax is a lighter dubbing. Alan uses rabbit. I'm using camel. Rabbit's perfectly fine, but the camel has a slightly longer staple and it will form a nice shroud. a little bit for a thorax. Then clip on the hackle pliers. Wrap a two-turn hackle. Simply trap and cut through to the eye. and finish off with a three turn whip finish. The hackle tip did not snip off clean so I have to sneak in with the scissors to trim it away. If it wants, and take away the thread. With a little bit of Velcro, I 
can tease out just a few of the strands of the dubbing to form just a slightly hazy shroud over the pattern. That completes Alan McGee's PMD Transition Flymph.